Phillies win 10 to 4 over the Tampa Bay Rays completing the sweep and I honestly don't know where the broom is or else I would do something a lot more clever than I just did. Before we start today's video, I was supposed to get a hat today and it was supposed to look like this. Ladies and gentlemen, if you could believe it, this is the crap I got smushed up in this box, not a Phillies hat, screw that website. You can't tell? I'm like pumped for this video, I don't know why. Hey, ben Levy makes a start, not to mention this 42 day, a lot of stuff going on, honoring Jackie Robinson. Yeah, it, yeah, a lot went on. Here's a pitch from Ben Lively to Denard Spann and... I don't think that ball's landed yet, guys. Rays take the lead on a f just destroyed baseball. They forgot about the first one, but not just to mention that one really quick. Hernandez was safe on a throwing error, and Andrew Knapp scored one to one. And then the Scott Kingery thing. Okay, yeah, cleared up. Score was actually four to two. I'm losing track of everything, and I don't know what's happening. Top of the fifth, the Rays got one back, but no fear, Reese Hoskins is here. He lines one into left center field, bringing in a run, and it's 5-2-3 Phillies. And then all of a sudden, there's a huge tornado warning in the sixth inning. Tampa Bay gets a new stadium, which ultimately, I think they move, may move to Montreal before they get a new stadium. They have to put a roof on it. There were, what, six or seven games, like, postponed on Sunday due to inclement weather? Like, You'd have to put a roof on it. If enough wasn't happening in this game, we got a hole in the roof, people. In the eighth inning, Michael Franco lines a sharp one to the third baseman. It goes under Matt Duffy's legs, two runs would score, and it's seven to three Phillies. What? Aaron all tear, my goodness, he tore that ball apart, making the score ten to three Phillies. The Rays would tack on one more, and that would be it as the Phillies finish off. Their sixth win on the row, eight of the last nine, and it's been a dominant performance, if I do say so myself. Alright, I have a question for all of you today, and I don't know what the answer is going to be, but this video is actually going to be pretty good, okay? Do you prefer ketchup or mustard on your hot dog? Leave the answer in the comments. The one that is the funniest to me will get pinned. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, make sure to hit the like button. If you really liked it, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Peace on the street, sign! Go Sixers.